Hey guys, it's Chris Greenwood, also known as Manifest. I'm a full-time rock artist and I coach other artists to make money with their music and make it a full-time career. In this video, I want to talk about how to get the attention of record labels. Just yesterday, I had an email from a record label that was like, hey man, um, love your stuff, um, wanted, wanted to see what your label situation was. And how did they find me? Well, I know they found me because of radio, because I'm starting to chart on the charts. Okay, um, we're about to hit the top 40 and then top 30 and go way beyond. We're already charting in some stuff with um, XM, uh, Sirius XM, Octane and stuff like that. And that's how I got my attention of them. Where are labels looking? Labels are looking at the radio charts. Why are they looking at the radio charts? Because radio is still the number one way that um, labels use to break artists. It's still the number one way to get that mass media and that mass attention. Yes, they use social media as well. They're looking at Spotify to see streams. They're looking to see who's added to um, uh, the different playlists. I got added to a really big playlist lately, so they might have come from there. They might have come from radio, they might have come to playlists. Um, you know, YouTube, I'm watching my YouTube number shoot up he could have been searching on YouTube but I'm pretty sure that it was because of radio and we're charting because these radio or, or these labels are trying to promote their acts to radio and get added and they're, they're they're getting their reports and they're like oh who's this guy manifest stones oh okay he got added okay I'm gonna go check this guy out starts checking me out looks up my contact sends me an email and I'll just say this when you do get contacted by a label normally it's pretty short and sweet if it's if it's something real if it's something tangible it's normally like one or two lines really short to the point when it gets to be this long thing and all this stuff you probably want to be a little bit more weary and of course if they got a website in their in their name and their email go check them out and always check to see if they're they're credible or not but um for me personally um, I'm not trying to get the attention of the label unless the uh, offer is going to come with six plus zeros, multiple six, seven zeros, because I've already spent so much money on my career investing and I have a fan base now. You know, I have a, a career that's been developed. I signed with the label already. I already kind of learned from my mistakes. And I always like to say this, you know, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Get out there, go make some great music, go market it, go uh, do something daring today. Cheers. Hey, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you found it valuable. Make sure you hit the subscribe button below so that you can get the more content that I'm releasing. Also, if you're a struggling artist and you're just trying to figure out this music industry, you want to go full time with your music, you want to get noticed on social media or learn how to launch an album, an EP, or just get your music more marketed out there, I want to encourage you to check out my coaching program called Fanbase University. Every single month, I jump on the phone two times with my students and I coach them and I teach them how to market their music, how to get noticed, how to handle booking agents, record labels, and just get their music out there. Also, you get access to exclusive training, you get in interviews with music industry professionals. If you want to find out more and not do this on your own, not struggle because I've wasted thousands of dollars on my career and I, now I want to coach other artists. Check out my program, fanbaseuniversity.com or click the link below to find out more info.